Yeah. All right, you, you seem tired. Are you all right? You ready to go? <laughs> First off, super gutsy performance. Um, you're up 5-0. All of a sudden, he starts storming back on you. I think you're having a hard time standing up, like right now. How much have you trained for this moment since you hurt your, your elbow? Not much, man. I took like a week, week and a half off, and then I've been on the mat maybe like twice, just doing like 30 minutes of real controlled stuff. So I'm a guy who gets really confident by the way he trains. So it's been it's been a struggle to come in here and like feel really like ready for a match not training like I'm used to, so that was kind of another obstacle. You feel like you're drowning a little bit almost as he starts, as you're like, you got no legs, you haven't trained, and yeah. you're, like you said, all your confidence is derived from how hard you train, and you, yeah. you didn't train. Yeah, it, uh, it sucks, but it's what you gotta do, so. Heart, oh, good. You said that, you know, on the mental side of things, right? You said you get confident by the way that you train. Have you looked into, you know, handling things a little bit differently mentally to go along with your, you know, the hard training on the mat? Um, kind of. I mean, there wasn't a lot of time to really like dissect it this time, but you know, I think just realizing that I can, I can bang still, you know, even, even hurt, and you just gotta trust that. You're gonna tough it out when you get there. Like you're just a tough person. That's what you gotta tell yourself. So. Uh, why is it so important for you to, to battle through that and come back for a third non-national? That's what I've always been preached was come and get the next best thing. And after coaching youth clubs for the past like two three years, that's what I preach down. So just practice what you preach. You know? Be an example. Yeah. I would say that's a heart and balls win. Would you say that that's true? Is that fair? Yeah. Yeah, it was tough. Is it a lot of uh, reacting once, you know, you're up 5-0 and he comes back, you know, it's 9-8 and things are getting close, a little more intense. Is it just a lot more reading and reacting, not not a lot of game planning when things like that happen? Yeah, I was just, I'm not going to shoot. I've been good against his shots on match. Um, so it's just like I'm not gonna shoot, whatever. I'm up. So. The last one where he's in on your legs. That's all right. I go over. Yeah. You okay? Yeah. Okay. <laughs>